What's up, YouTube? This is Too Raw for TV. Um, <clears throat> those of you who are fans of wrestling, and in particular, Extreme Championship Wrestling, or ECW, um, I have some sad news to bring to you all, and that is that Jerome Young, who was better known to the professional wrestling world as New Jack, has passed away at the age of 58. Um, his passing was confirmed today. Uh, his wife uh, verified that he died of a heart attack in his North Carolina home. New Jack may be best remembered as one of the most controversial individuals in professional wrestling. He was best known during his run in extreme championship wrestling during the late 1990s, where he was a multiple-time tag team champion with Mustafa and John Cronus. He remained active in professional wrestling, recently having matches as late as April of this year, with others occurring back in 2019. He will be remembered for some of the most brutal matches to behold. He could be found putting opponents through tables, throwing them off high ledges, and doing so with a level of disdain that was unheard of. His matches would begin as he would come out to the ring with a shopping cart full of weapons, even stabbing one opponent during a match. The popular documentary series Dark Side of the Ring covered his career during season two, and it was one of the more popular episodes of that season. He was also featured in another well-known pro wrestling document, Beyond the Mat, back in 1999. He's probably one of the more exciting in-ring performers of the past 20 to 25 years, uh, but maybe because of the fact that he starred in ECW and never, uh, you know, reached WCW or WWE. Um, which would probably would require him to tone down, tone down his persona somewhat. Um, he never really got the justice that he deserved as a performer. But uh, rest in peace to New Jack, um, a, a truly great in-ring performer and great wrestler.